Now I remember this place. It's Sir Howard Wilkins' mansion. Flashback. Welcome, Dr. Smith. Lady Wilkins is waiting for you. She is rather worried about Sir Howard's illness. She fears he's gone completely mad. Oh! <laughs> yes. I have to see her at once, then. Certainly, sir. Follow me, please. <laughs> Anyways, though, we got a flashback there. What do we do now? We start these statues, because that's what we're doing right now. Statue of Wyvern. Nothing unusual about it. There's a hole in the eye of the statue, which is a small ruby might fit put in. Yep. I forget what it does. Statue of Iron One Eye is something that has a small ruby. We're going to have to find another small ruby then. Now, I forget exactly what we're supposed to be doing, but I remember there's a few doors in here. So we're going to go in this way first. But if it was not locked. So we'll just go over here instead. I remember this area very nicely. Let's see if I remember how to do this, though. This is a portrait of Sir Howard Wilkins. He looks like from the, he's like a fat version of that guy from Star Trek. I'd have you watch the show and kind of take a suit. It's a fire, it's seems recent. Alright, so file various books, what they called gothic genre. Me and Keith opened that locked door like in every game ever. There was grotesque stories, and this is all so fascinating and interesting. Come on, little chibi me, we're gonna go back out and we're gonna head right up them stairs. We're gonna tackle them stairs and go. <laughs> yeah, he's at the top of them stairs. You're at the top of your game. Let's go in here. Oh, weird blurry effect to suggest I am higher over something somewhere. There's blood here and a piece of paper. There's a note here. Travis, he did something to me. Don't try to find me, please. I might endanger you. I'll be the one to find you when it's time. Okay, so he's gonna find us when it's time. <laughs> what a nice fellow. Thinking about others, even all the way to his bloody death. Anyways, I forget if this door's open or not. The door's locked, and it's locked, and we'll go over here. Anyways, we're going mom, 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 mom. Candles, random pastries, or something that they line up on the walls. It sounds like it's a lock from the other side. How do you know that from listening? Hmm, I hear this lock noise. It must be locked from the other side. I got friends on them. This room is the one I was staying in. It appears to be safe. No, nothing bad has happened yet. Uh, the backup sheets are dusty. Lantern, bed, so I rest here. No, I don't need fucking sleep. This is my diary. Maybe that'll solve some mysteries. September the 15th, 1886. I have almost arrived to Sir Hallward and Wilkins Mansion. It's been a long journey and I am very tired. On her letter, Lady Thelma told me that her husband has gone mad. I don't know what quite to make of this, but I hope as a friend it's not something serious. As a psychiatrist, however, I fear for the worst. September the 16th, 1886. I examined Sir Howard for the first time tonight. The results are not positive. He has been obsessed with some recent research of his that somehow of his that is somehow connected with some religious cult, but I was unable to understand. However, he said that he will show me what he speaks of tomorrow morning. I'm looking forward to a good night's sleep, but something makes me feel uneasy. Hmm. Doesn't explain much. Yeah, it doesn't explain much. It involves a religious cult. Silent Hill! Same game, why not? We've already saved a bajillion million times. We'll just go right in here. Right into the bathroom. To the Huda! There is a medicine here. Did the medicine just turn into a fucking meat when I looked at it? What the fuck? Uh, well, we took medicine. That's our healing items. I'm pretty sure inside this game. Anyways, though, there's nothing else to do in the loo, so we're headed right back out. Right back out again. Anyways, there's another room down here after we look at this. The book's entitled Dante's Inferno. Hmm. Symbolism, possibly. This room does not look mildly creepy. The door is locked with a small metallic lock. I can't open it as is. Let's go inside this mysterious room, but it's stuck, so I can't open it. What the fuck? We'll keep this all in mind as we continue to explore this mysterious Sir Howard's mansion. And now we'll find ourselves on the other side of this passageway. It's locked. So many things from the other side. How can you tell? Sheets, candles, more things to read. We'll go in here first. Huh. Portrait of Thelma Wilkins. Who the hell is Thelma Wilkins? Well, it must be the wife of this dude, because he's right over here. There's something right down there, but I first want to examine this jewelry box. Absurd clothes kept inside the closet. 
closet. Many colorful dresses sell for a late welcome to his bad taste. A few fake accessories inside the drawers. And a funny hat. What's in here? Chest is locked at this moment. Ah, fuck. We need so many fucking keys. Just, just like Resident Evil. But I love Resident Evil. And the music suddenly stops. Everything gets all serious. We're going back in. Something doesn't seem right in here. Something is bogging me. What is this? There's a hole in the wall. Crawl inside. <gasps> Dead body. What the hell is this? Who could have done this? Sir Howard? Maybe he went completely mad. This is disgusting. It looks like the victim was hacked to death and then vital organs removed for medical purposes. Broken bowels and used medical junk thrown in the air. Among the metal balls, there is a viral of acid. It has all sorts of soft medical items. Might come in handy. I will take it. Various medical bottles. Boy, what is this? Medical books. Papers. Note, there is some kind of report here. The subject resists the possession. The transfer appears to be incomplete. Dressing measures shall be taken. Possessed transfer? What kind of medical report is that? Oh, the pieces are coming together. <laughs> Sounds like it's locked on the other side. Fuck, why could anything be locked on this side? There's a hole in the wall. Crawl inside. We make our way back. What? Don't move! One step, and you're dead. Don't shoot! I mean you no harm. Who are you? What are you doing in this cursed place? My name is Henry Smith. I'm a psychiatrist. I came here at request of Thelma Wilkins to examine her husband, Sir Howard. Oh yeah? You think he was crazy, doctor? He was the crazy doctor? Huh? What's your professional diagnosis? He... He's a goddamn lunatic! That's what he is! I saw him slay his butler! You're lucky he didn't slay you! You mean he's wandering around this house as we speak? And he's not the only one! It appears there are more lunatics around! My white god attacked and ran away! When I find her, I'm out of here in an instant! You know a way out of here? Yes, I do, but the doctor is locked. Like most doors here. It's the one at the back, and my memory is right. It leads to the country, the courtyard, and then the forest, and so on. I'll find the key for the door. You go find your wife. Right. And he goes out. Oh, and by the way, my name is Travis. I'll see you on the way out. Mysterious. I'll use our acid on this. Use the acid to melt it? Yes. Inside a chest is an emblem. Also, there's a diary that belongs to Thelma Wilkins. September the 16th. I mean, the 10th, and not the 16th. I fear my husband is going mad. He spends more and more time in that secret lab of his. Last night, I heard screaming coming from there. Maybe I imagined it. September the 11th. Howard was very angry today. I have no idea why. I decided to call the psychiatrist behind Rebecca's party. Maybe you can help him. I fear for his mental health. Step of the twelfth. That's it. When he's out of the lab, I'm going to order my workers to grab and tie him to our bed. This has gone far enough. He's attacked the cocoa was breaking her leg. September the thirteenth. He stopped screaming about an hour ago. I still can't find the lab and his key. Well, there's a typo there. To his lab. The key to his lab. I'm sure he's hiding something terrible in there. I just hope he hasn't gone too far. Anyways, we got an emblem. That is exactly what we needed. But who knows what's inside this cursed place? I don't know what's inside this cursed door. Door not stuck. I don't think I can open it. Alright, so that is useless. And we're having some lag here. Lag time! Wow. That is...